Why are Bitcoin daily transactions making new all-time highs? Welcome to The Recap, where we bring you the most important and interesting Bitcoin and crypto news nuggets of the week. Last week, due to a lesser known BIP, Bitcoin Improvement Proposal, Bitcoin daily transactions kept making new all-time highs. Interest rates and bank failures, the new second largest such failure in US history, are not the only things that are up, fortunately. Bitcoin daily transactions, minor revenue, and percentage of supply being hodled long-term are also on the rise. Remember Bitcoin ordinals? Well, now Bitcoin does fungible tokens as well. And BRC20, the new standard for issuing fungible tokens on the Bitcoin blockchain, is on a tear. Bitcoin transactions are hitting new record highs. Fungible assets on Bitcoin have reached a collective market cap of $167 million Canadian. Developers have been building and experimenting with new, interesting projects on the Bitcoin protocol for years now. And the market is saying yes. Please, sir, can I have Meanwhile, the White House produced a new budget proposal called DAME. If accepted, the Digital Asset Mining Energy Excise Tax, which is exactly what it sounds like, would impose a 30% tax on all energy used to mine Bitcoin over the next few years. What's next? A video game or reality TV energy tax? Finally, We recently shared with you that the Kingdom of Bhutan had been quietly stacking sats as well as other digital assets over the last few years. Apparently, they've also been using surplus hydroelectric power to mine the stuff too. British Columbia, Manitoba, New Brunswick, and Quebec should take note. BTC was down 2.75% last week and Ethereum was up 0.02%. Check out ndax.io forward slash blog for all the links to the news items covered above. Start your free account at ndax.io today.